We were working with local military anti-drug forces, a search and destroy mission on cocaine labs. Lieutenant Dobbs and I have been training local pilots and Cobras for their own strike forces against the cartel. Lead, this is Snake 2, entering Sector 4079. Roger, advise Calibra Ops of our position. Wilco, Dobbs. How's the view up front, buddy? I'm not crazy about it, man. I'll be glad when we get out of this canyon. I was flying wing that day with Captain Tejada. Lieutenant Dobbs, the other American, was with Captain Mendez, the flight leader in the front Cobra. Between the two Cobras was a Black Hawk helicopter with the support team of American and South American DEA agents. It was our fourth mission as a team, and we'd worked well together. We were entering a sector we'd never been before. It was rumored among the locals that this was an area of offensive cartel activity, but we were used to such rumors. We were five miles from the objective when we saw the Scorpion attack helicopter. Dobbs, bogey at your 12 o'clock. Dobbs! Snake 2 to Blackhawk, get the hell out of there. The Blackhawk began a base of action, but the Scorpion was too fast. Heavily armed and hard to find. The pilot was better than anyone I'd ever seen before. I tried to pull the Scorpion away from the Blackhawk, but to no use. He was a cold killer. Tejada! Tejada! Wake up, goddammit! I took the controls, put it in a dive, and crossed over the top of the Scorpion before he could fire. And I made it out of the area. said the cartel was up to something. I'm not blaming anybody. Last time I looked, we were all on the same side. We have some decisions to make. Thank you, Mr. Preston. That will be all. May I say something, sir? Go ahead. I volunteered to fly with these local anti-drug forces, sir. And I watched the men in those choppers put their lives on the line for their families and their country every day. The cartel has them outpaid, outmanned, and outgunned. But knowing that, they still went out. And they didn't stand a chance. They're heroes, and they should be avenged. It's a little more complicated than that. I beg your pardon, sir, but I think it's very simple. They killed our people, and they killed our friends. Their drugs kill Americans every day. It's a war, and it's our duty to fight. Thank you, Mr. Preston. You're excused. <laughs>